what I find really works at Artest is um, trying to get an understanding of what people want to do, what are their aspirations with painting. Often getting them to come in with images of artworks that they love, what they like or that confuse them can help. It sort of gives me an idea where they want to go with their painting, what they want to do. Um, and I think once that's sort of managed, or not managed, once, that, once I understand that, I can sort of really move on with giving them the a practical set of tools to be able to do that. Um, and when they, I guess when you reconcile that aspirational aspect of the art with the technical aspect of the art, that's where style happens of all, for all ages. And that's where artists or students wanting to be artists, in, in that moment, they're in the flow, and that's where you, you'll see a style really start to come through. You know, you really, as a teacher, you really want difference with paintings. You want or difference with approaches to painting. We give them a set of tools, we talk about tone, we talk about line, colour, surface or material. Um, but then after that, it's entirely up to them in terms of where they go. What I like teaching about artists is, is a variety of students, different levels, different ages, different backgrounds, all coming to the sort of art making process from, from different points of view. Um, that makes it interesting for me. I find one of the things that I get out of my classes is all the students come out with a different painting. Uh, I, I couldn't imagine doing one of those classes where everyone paints the same vase or flowers or whatever it may be. Um, I kind of like the idea of there being a variety of approaches to art making because you know, when you look at art making from representation to abstraction there's a, there's a huge range of different things that can be done around art. I think you just got to get up, put a brush in your hand and start making, start moving paint around. If there was an answer that would be it for me.